live from the Red Hawks New City Broadcast Studio, your source for morning news. Here are your announcements for Thursday, April 25th, day 6 on the school calendar. Just a reminder that it will be grade 5, 6 intramurals today instead of the grade 7, 8s. Let's kick things off with sports. Get it? Kick? Sports? Bro! Right, sorry. Yesterday, the junior high badminton team competed at in the divisional finals tournament in Morris. All the players faced tough competition and played super well. Lyle and Georgia both finished in fourth place in the boys and girls singles categories, and a big congratulations goes out to Logan Mazinki for winning the championship game in the boys singles category. All junior high badminton players, please hand in your jerseys to Miss Lento by Monday. At school today, it is day two of the worker readiness course starting at 12.25 p.m. in Miss Isby's classroom. A big thank you goes out to Mr. Annie Reimer for coming to our school to deliver this course to our students. Meanwhile, all Anne Green Gables cast members don't forget to be at rehearsal from 3.20 to 5.20. News out of Mr. Waldner's playoff hockey pool, the standings are just in after another stunning upset by Carolina in the first round of the playoffs last night. In the individual standings, Lorena from grade 7 holds a one-point lead over Emily from the grade 3, 4, 8. Lorena was able to pick six of eight improbable first-round winners. In other events, did you know that it was confirmed by the Vegas bookmakers that not a single bet was placed on the Blue Jackets sweeping the Lightning? It turns out Levi Voth knew something that nobody else did as he successfully picked Columbus to beat Tampa Bay in four games. And Kenny, the grade 3, 4, 8 class and the grade 8 class are battling it out for the overall class lead. Just a reminder that the class winner gets a free Red Hawks Cafe lunch. Stay tuned for more upsets in round two. This week's Red Hawk of the Week is Mrs. Davidson. Her class won Trigger Thursday for the second time last week. And they decided to pay their prizes forward to the grade three fours who came in second place. That is a great example of a random act of kindness that makes our school great. Thanks to Mrs. Davidson and her class for setting such a great example. Speaking of Trivia Thursday, it's Trivia Thursday. Teachers, get your chat windows ready because the prize for the fastest and most accurate class today is 24 Tim Hortons Donuts. Here is your question. Good morning, Red Hawks. My name is Cindy Mia, and I'm the Deaf and Hard of Hearing Consultant for Rosenort School. Your trivia question for Thursday is, what does the following American Sign Language, ASL, phrase mean? Are you ready for your answer? The answer is, have a good, long weekend. And congratulations to Lisa Craker's class. Please have a student come down to the broadcast center to claim your delicious prize. Oh, make that 23 dons. All right. The, three, the R360 News team would like to wish a happy birthday going out to Clea Siemens on Saturday. <coughs> and to Aiden Saracen and Don Gellert on Sunday. That's all we have for you today. Have a fantastic day at Road North School.